Hello and welcome to this session. Today we will learn how to use setup and teardown in robot framework. So in robot framework we can have test case setup, we can have test case teardown and then we can have test suite setup and test suite teardown. So what does this mean? So test case setup will run before every test case and test case teardown will run after every test case similarly test suite setup will run before test suite so this will run once before all the test cases in the test suite and this will run after test suite so that means it will run only once after all the test cases in that test suite are completed. So this is what test case setup and teardown is. Now to create test case setup and teardown in our framework, I will go to my Eclipse and I'll go to the project that we have been creating in the earlier session, which is this project. And here is we have our test suite and here I can create the setup and teardown and setup and teardown we create in the settings section. And here if you start typing setup and press control spacebar you will see the option we have test suite setup and test setup so i will say test suite setup here and i will give the message i am inside test suite setup now you can give a i will say log so i have to use some keyword here and I'll use this log and let me copy this so I'm using log keyword and this message now you can use any keywords built-in or custom like user defined as well so for example in the early session we created some custom keywords you can also use the custom keywords in setup and teardown as of now just to show you the use I'm using a log statement to log this statement I'm inside test suite setup and then if you see tear down, I will say tear down and press control space bar. We have a test view tear down here again. I will log. I am inside test suite tear down and then again I will say setup and press control space bar this time I will create a test setup and again I will log I am inside test setup and tear down test tear down I will say log I am inside test tear down so I have created this setup and tear down I will save my test and run this so let me run this entire suite I can run this from here I can just expand here and do a right click on this suite and say run as robot test so I need to have my console let me open my console and I will just keep my console here yeah and now I can run this I will say run as robot test and this should start our test and it should run all the tests in our test suite and yes this is done and if I see the report so okay this is the second test that is running now this is done and if I go and see the report this is my report I'll copy this go to a browser and open the report in the browser and everything is passed if I go to log you can see the log if I expand this test suite and here you can see here it logs in I am inside test suite setup once and then in the teardown it logs in I am inside test suite teardown however if you see in every test case you will find I am inside test setup and I am inside test teardown in test 2 as well you will find this 
I am inside test setup and then I am inside test tier down in test day, test 3 also you will find the setup I am inside test setup and then I am inside test tier down so this is what test setup and tear down is now the use here it will be so for all the actions that you want to do before your test cases or before all the test cases you can put into a test suite setup and if you want to do some action after all the test cases you can put in test suite tear down an example will be if you want to open and set the browser properties like implicit weights and all those things you can put into test suite setup and then run all the test cases on that browser and then finally in the test suite tear down you can close the browser you can also uh, use setup and tear down for getting the data from databases or uh, reverting back to the original state all these actions you can do in setup and tear down so this is all about setup and tear down in robot framework i hope this session was very useful for you thank you for watching